What is popping besties? It is your girl Pascaline and I am back with another YouTube video. Now, if this is your first time seeing my face, hello, hi, welcome to the gang. I hope you stick around. In today's video, I am going to be talking about what to do when you are struggling to find yourself. Let's get straight into today's video. I would like to tell you that life is not a straight road. Life is not straight. Life is always going to be under construction. Okay, we have been through my own ups. I've had my own fair, fair share of my up times and my down times. I've had times when I had to question who I am. But there are things that I want you to understand. Being lost or struggling to find yourself means you are going somewhere in the first place. You are growing. If you are still the same person, you were 10 years ago five years ago two years ago you would not be struggling to find yourself now okay you're growing and that is a beautiful thing struggling to find yourself is not always a bad thing you are growing you are evolving as a human being so it means you are growing you are trying to move from where you are right now to another place and that is what i want you to understand so stop beating yourself up that you don't know what you are right now okay so first things first, when you are lost, what's the first thing you do? You ask for direction. You ask somebody, oh, do you know this place? What is happening? I want to really know. Can you help me get to this place? If you're struggling to find yourself, the first thing I would say is for you to pray. Talk to God. Like you're not your own creator. Talk to God. God is going to intervene. God is going to hear you. God is going to show you the way. Just pray and trust that God knows the best and that your life is moving to somewhere better because everything works out for your good. Okay, God has said it that everything works out for our good. And no matter what, no matter if you think that you're so far off from God, trust me, prayer does not have to be like you have to, does not have to be you shouting and you know, you can just talk to God like a friend, like God, this is what I'm going through right now and I need your direction. Holy Spirit, help me. Okay? So that is the thing you do. When you're lost in an empty street or you're lost in a road that you don't know anything about, you ask people for help. So ask God to show you direction, to direct you, to show you where you should, what you, you should do. Okay? Yes get off social media like stop using social media for a while for a long long time stop using social media social media has influenced our life positively and negatively no matter how you want to put it social media can be good it can be bad but the thing with social media is it influences consciously or unconsciously you don't even know when you're picking up on things that are not you most of the time okay things that are not your own opinion when you are around a lot of opinions what happens you start to doubt yourself sometimes you don't even know if you're thinking from your own opinion or you're thinking from what society expects of you okay so get off social media opinions of things keep changing when it comes to social media a lot of things are changing every single day sometimes you don't even realize it but your opinions start changing sometimes you watch a video and you're like oh yeah you watch a video on your for you page and you you have your own opinion and then you go to the comment section and you start reading other people's opinion and you're like um maybe that is right and stuff like that so it influences a lot so when you're struggling to find yourself you don't need that noise that constant noise of other people's plans other people's goals other people's the way they want to see their their life and everything coming into your head like okay you don't need that all right you don't need that so you need to get off social media when we are kids we all had like dreams and goals and aspirations and things we wanted to do for ourselves but growing up a lot of opinions have changed about a lot of things not just because we are evolving as human beings but also because you think that is what you should do you think that is the next step for you to take you're always taking in this society's idea and forgetting that when you keep taking in other people's opinion you are suppressing your own and before you know it you'll get so caught up in like oh my god i don't even think i don't even know what this is i don't even know what any of this is and you don't know where you are again you're lost so you have to cut down on like social media and the other thing is before you do anything ask yourself am i doing this thing because i want to do this or because it is what a society expects of me 
okay am i going to university because i want to go to university or because it is what society expects of me am i starting a family because i want to or because this is what is supposed to be next by society standards these are things you need to think about which brings me to the next thing i want to say meditation spend time with your own thoughts meditation does not mean oh, like you sit down like this oh, and close your eye that is a form of meditation but just having a quiet time thinking about reflecting on your own being on your own being around your own thoughts around your own opinions okay that is going to help you so much that is really going to help you and again i just wanted to remind you guys that struggling to find yourself is not necessarily a bad thing it's a sign that you have grown it's a sign that you've you've outgrown the norm is is a sign that you have passed that stage of where you used to be okay and now you're struggling to find yourself again so it is not a bad thing my darling okay and also in life it's not actually about what you experience it's how you experience it it's not about your destination it's about the journey okay that journey enjoy that journey enjoy this process because let me tell you you struggling to find yourself it is part of the story that you're going to tell when you're actually accomplished just know that it's a process sometimes if you just get every single thing on a platter without having to struggle, without having to go through all these trying times, you will not appreciate it as when you have gone through those trying times. Do you understand what I'm trying to say? So enjoy that process. The important thing is not the destination. It's not the cake. It's the process that led up to the cake is what is important. When you're struggling to find yourself, I'll advise you to live for who you want to be write down the characteristics of where you see yourself that destination write down those this the destination what that person is doing now what that person eats like what that person feels like what that person's morning routine is like that is not you right now that is you where you see yourself in the future and make sure that your presence aligns with what you're doing like before you do a goal like before you sleep in, in the night in the in sleeping like snooze your alarm and sleep in you ask yourself would my future self that i have that goal for would that person sleep in like live for who you want to be it can be stressful to do but when you adapt all the habits of that person you want to become you would eventually in your present become that person start writing down everything how you feel write down everything writing is such a therapeutic thing to do writing down your emotions pinning them down on a paper is a way of releasing the sometimes when i am writing stuff i i draw back and realize that whoo i did not even know i was going through this i didn't even know this was the cause of this i did not even know that this was this and then you put things together okay i hope that these steps help you in some way to find who you are because it's a very trying time but that is why i'm also giving you guys the comfort that you struggling to find yourself is not a bad thing okay it is not a bad thing at all it shows that you are moving it shows that you are moving from one place to another and that is what i want you to remember and that is what i want you to understand okay i am so proud of you well done you're doing so well keep going god is with you if you pray i trust me god will not forsake you he is your father like he's your creator he's not going to forsake you so make sure that you draw close to him in this time okay and also do the things that make you happy i know you're struggling to find yourself but like the things that used to make you happy do them like find those things and bask in them so that you're not always isolating yourself and just thinking and just worrying you're beating yourself up for worrying and then you're beating yourself because of the fact that you are worrying which is basically the feedback loop from hell so like don't do that okay imagine you have anxiety and then you're you're having anxiety because of the fact that you're having anxiety that is not what i'm about to be doing okay my loves thank you so much for watching this video if you liked the video please give me a thumbs up do not forget to like comment and subscribe to be part of my bestie gang because my bestie gang is lit and tell me do you guys like this look i'm going to see the barbie movie that is why i, I look like this it's going to be on a vlog so 
yeah wait for that i love you so much and i can't wait to see you in my next video bye i love you Thank you.